my gosh. How precious is this? This is wild. Oh my god. Hi, baby. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello, baby. I gotta pet his nose. Snout. Hi. Oh my god. Still soft? <laughs> I did not think I would be doing this on a Monday. Uh huh. How wow. Cool is this? Hey peeps, I'm at the ranch. Oh my God, I am at the horse barn. <laughs> yes, we have a horse barn. Yes, come inside the horse barn, Fab. So what's so cool, don't you like my hat? Yes. You know, when I bought this hat, I never knew what I was gonna use it for, but now I know. It's, it's, my, it's my ranch hat. <laughs> Somebody just asked me the other day, what's the difference between a ranch and a farm? Farm has animals. Is it? Because <laughs> when I was a little girl and I was on the ranch, we had animals. So I don't know. Maybe we need to ask the viewers, what's the difference between a farm and a ranch? I think in Texas, we call everything ranches. Okay. And I think when you're in maybe up north or something, you call it a farm. I don't know. Oh. I don't know. Okay. Okay. So we're at my ranch slash farm. <laughs> Anyways, we are inside the horse barn. Let me take this thing off. So what's really cool inside the horse barn is there's already a bathroom right here. So how many, how many, how many horse barns have a, a bathroom like this, right? <laughs> Pretty damn cool. So what's really cool about this is I'm not going to use it as a horse barn. Oh. I am literally going to use it as a, uh, a, uh, wow. That's nice and cool in there too. The air, air conditioning must have come through. Um, I'm going to use it as an office for my husband. So you guys know we have the office down by the freeway uh, down in Spring, Texas, uh, which is next to the Woodlands. Um, so I'm going to convert this into an office for my husband. So I'm going to be busy renovating, busy. renovating this. How cool is this? So I'm going to leave all the tongue and groove or whatever this is. Maybe it's not tongue and groove. Maybe it's just wood. I don't know. But um, I'm going to leave it all up. We're going to make sure it's very well insulated. I'm going to pour more concrete to make the floors even. I'm going to do a stained concrete floor. Yes. And I'm going to tear out these stalls and make it all nice and big and open. And everywhere you see big barn doors, I'm going to put big glass doors. Nice. Yes. Please tell me we get to see it all. Yes. Yes. Don't you think it'll be fun to show? Oh, yeah. I mean, like, so this is just part of the renovations that the I'm before. going to be doing. Huh? <laughs> the before. <laughs> the before. The before. And then we've got space over here. I'm hoping I can actually tear both this wall out that goes between that door and this door and create a nice kitchen area. Oh. Yes. And then what's really cool is there's a door right here. Oh, up there. There's a two bedroom apartment above my ground. Oh, okay, that's all you had to say. I will see you later. <laughs> I'll be living up here. I don't know what I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. But oh. you know, yeah, maybe maybe if you become homeless, Fab. <laughs> I'll let you live here in the horse barn, above the horse barn. But yeah, so what's really cool is uh, this is going to become my husband's new office. So it's roughly about uh, 1,800 square feet, which I think is the same size as our office down in spring. Are you guys ready to see a series about Romer's Acres? Ready. And out this way, I'm actually in this area here, I'm going to build raised garden boxes. Ooh. Yes, yes. So I want to build those raised garden boxes where I can grow my own vegetables. Okay. So you know how when you go to the grocery store, you're always buying organic vegetables and everything because it's supposed to be better for you and everything. Well, I figure it can't get any more organic than me growing it myself, right? All right. Come on, Romer Market. So <laughs> Romer's Acres, <laughs> Romer's Market. <laughs> So yeah, so I'm, I'm going way back to my roots. I, I remember as a little girl having to, it's, it was called hoeing the garden, hoeing. The garden. Like there's a, a instrument called a hoe 
and you literally that's how you weed your garden and get rid of the weeds and everything or pull them by hand or whatever so anyways um i'm, I'm excited i'm i so all weekend i investigated raised garden boxes and the covers that go over it to make it like a little greenhouse in the winter time so you can still keep growing vegetables I'm excited. I feel like you're going to teach us a lot. Yes. We're going to learn a lot. Yes. Yes. So my inspiration for this is just off the charts. Like I am so inspired to just this, this ranch is going to bring life to me. Like I'm so excited. Get away from the hustle, the bustle, the drama, the shit, and just listen how quiet. So cool, so ah, I, uh, but I, uh, I'm just so you're all like, okay, where's this motivation Monday coming from? I'm like, I'm so motivated to just create a much calmer life. You know, I mean, like, I don't mind putting myself out there. People are like, well, why won't you give us the where your ranch is? Why won't you tell us? Okay, first of all, I don't mind showing you the ranch and showing you the things on the ranch, but I'm not going to reveal the address because I don't need weirdos. I don't know. I don't. I don't need people bothering me. It's. It's. I will show you my life. I love showing you my life, but I don't need y'all to come bother me at the ranch. <laughs> I'm out here for peace and tranquility, not to be bothered. So anyways, we will, we're going to turn this into Romer's Acres. We, you will be along for the ride. Uh, they were out here, uh, had them out here mowing and got so much stuff cleared out and mowed down and everything. So now I can really have the vision of my, where, where I want my garden boxes and everything. So this is just like so cool, guys. You will just You'll be along for the ride. So, welcome to my home. <laughs> Some people are like, how big is the house that's at the ranch? <laughs> Here you go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. He's like, this is my house. This, he's like, this is my house, bitch. <laughs> Some people are like, I bet the house is really little. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> no, guess what this place is? What is it? This is the house for the water well. Oh. Yeah, there's no such thing as city water <laughs> when you're on a ranch. You have to have your own water well. So this is the water well house. This is the house for the water well. Right. There you go. <laughs> you really are on a ranch. <laughs> and I have septic systems. What's that? Septic tanks. Oh. Because I don't have city, there's no such thing as city city sewer out here either. So I got water wells, I've got septic systems, septic tanks. <laughs> really on I'm on my own out here, guys. <laughs> so some of you are like, well, when do we get to see the house? When do we get to see the house? It's it coming. <laughs> it's coming, guys. It's coming. You know, if I have a horse barn with a two-bedroom apartment above it, the house is not little. <laughs> So, let's go talk about some inspiration and motivation. So look at this. How cool is this, Dad? Have you ever been this close to horses? No. Oh. oh my God. Have you ever even petted a horse? No. Mm. I'm mean, like, if, if you said you've never been close to horses. No. Look at that. Two little Shetland ponies over here. Two big horses over here. How cool is that? Hi guys. I wonder if I can pet them. Isn't this much better now that everything's cleared out? Mm-hmm. You can actually like walk. Hi baby. Hi baby. What are you guys doing over here? This is what I need, Fab. Oh look, they got little things on their heads. Oh. Hi guys. Hi guys. Can they even see? Look at them. Look at the little baby Shetland pony. Oh, look at this. Hi baby. 
Well, hi, baby. Hi, baby. Oh, aren't you pretty? You are precious. Oh, my goodness. Look at you. You've got little boots on. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm going to love coming over here and petting you guys. Yes. Oh, hi, baby. Hi, baby girl. Are you a girl or a boy? Hi, baby. Oh, here comes little Shetland pony. He's excited. He's so excited. They're like, oh my gosh. Who's this? A new person. A new person. Yeah. Hi, baby. I don't know what the purpose of the, of the little mask thing. I don't know. Hi, baby. But they could see out of it. Right. It's like a netting. Hi, baby. Oh my gosh, how precious is this? This is wild. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. Hi, baby. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello, baby. Oh, cute. You gotta pet his nose. Snout. Hi. Oh my god. Is that soft? <laughs> I did not think I would be doing this on a Monday. Uh -huh. how wow. How cool is this? Hi, baby. You gotta find out what you get to have for treats. Yes. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at you. Oh my goodness. You ever petted a horse? No? No. <laughs> this is wild. <laughs> Come pet him. Or him. I, I don't look shit. Oh my god. Yes, you're a strong horse. Look at you. Got some vine. Oh, what? What? <laughs> Look at you, little guy. Hi. Hi. Oh, you're so cute. You're a little baby. Thank you. You're a little baby horse. Yes. You're just a little baby. God, look at this little braid. Oh. <laughs> Hi, babies. Oh, my God. So cute. Well, guys, welcome to the ranch. I'm glad my neighbors have horses so I can get my horse fixed here. There you go. Let's get back to the house. So, there's the front step. <laughs> front step of the house. I love this. Gorgeous. It's giving me some Italian vibes or something. I don't know what it is, but anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. It's all about change and welcoming change. Remember that favorite book of mine, Who Moved My Cheese? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Fab, have you read that one lately? Mm -hmm. No, but I remember it. <laughs> I'm always stiffing out for that cheese. <laughs> are you staying in the same spot? No, ma'am. We're no. moving forward. We are moving forward all the time. So, guys, this is all about change. I'm changing in my life. Oh, I know all the hateful comments out there. Oh, you're copying this person. You're copying that person. People, you know, you might as well say that about half the world because, especially in the United States, People from New York City, California, they are all leaving the cities. Oh, even here in Houston, people are leaving the cities and they're moving to the country. Why? Because they're all working from home. They want more space, peace of mind, get out of that damn rat race and just go live a more peaceful, calming life. There's a hint, I'm still in Texas, people. The ranch is in Texas. I didn't leave Texas. <laughs> you have you have to remember, I want the ranch to be accessible on the weekends, whatnot, you know? So it's gotta be within driving distance. So um, I am going to bring you guys along for this amazing new chapter in my life. It's just, I can feel it. It's just, it's gonna be so tranquil, so relaxing. I think Fab, you're gonna have so much fun filming at the ranch with me. <laughs> it's just, can you hear the fountain in the background? Mm -hmm. I have a big old pond on my property. This ranch has everything. Just Horse barn, ponds. I'm going to stock the pond with fish. Listen there. Don't hear any cars. Don't hear any trains. Don't hear any traffic. Don't hear... Nothing, just peacefulness. So guys, just remember, change is good. 
not all change is bad. Change is good, especially when you think about it. Remember I tell you, you need to visualize. You need to manifest it into reality. And this is something that I've been thinking about for a long time. And so I, I just, I'm gonna love spending time out here. I just am. Can you wait to come out here with me, Fab? I'm, I'm ready, I'm ready. <laughs> You shouldn't have told me about that little apartment back there. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'll leave the city right now. <laughs> I could use this. There's no tea. nightclubs out here, Fab. <sighs> we'll have to create one back there. <laughs> your your little uh, nightclub scenes, <laughs> not out here. So anyways, guys, that, that's the premise of this whole video today is welcome change, embrace it, manifest it, make it happen in your life. I just... I'm ready for this chapter. I'm ready to do this new series with you, Romer's Acres. I cannot wait. You're gonna have so much fun doing this with me. I, I swear to God. It's, uh, so, with that said, guys, get out there. Find me everywhere. Be prepared to watch some funny, funny ass shit here. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be fun. And Fab, we're, we're gonna have to get you one of these hats too. I know, I'm gonna have to give me one of them here. <laughs> get you some boots, mm -hmm. get rid of those damn tennis shoes, <laughs> give you some boots. So, with that said guys, have a fabulous week. Stay tuned for some amazing videos. And until next time, bye bye.